Hi, this is Marty with Sumner One Service. Today we're gonna to show you how to set up, print to, and release jobs to the custom user box and secure printing. The first thing we want is the IP address of the machine. Enter that into the web browser, address field, and press enter. That'll pull up the Konica Minolta web connection. Once here, we wanna click where it says box user box list, new registration. Here, the fields of concern are the user box name, password, if you'd like a password, you could enter one here. In this case, I'm gonna leave that field blank. ABC, C for Caleb. And down here, you can specify the days, how many days pass until you delete a document or a document deletes automatically. I'll leave that at 24 hours, one day, and I'll press OK. Here I can create additional user boxes, but I'll just return to the box list. Now we'll create a user box from the control panel. Press the utility button, one touch user box registration, create user box, public personal user box, here, we'll press new. Here's where we can enter the user box name. And we can choose a password if we like. If we leave this field blank, we can open the box without a password. Press OK and close out. Now we'll print to the user box. I'm gonna open up a test document here, file print, select the correct printer, click on printer properties. When this window opens, I'm going to click on the basic tab. Then I'll choose output method. I'll change print, which is the default. Change that to save in user box. Now, typically the first time you do this, a window will appear. That window I can access by pressing user settings, but I've already done this before. So it will not open automatically, but this is the window that will appear. And this is where we'll pick the user box. Leave file name blank because it will name itself the name of the document. I chose user box number two. This was test. Number three was Caleb. Number one was Marty, but in this case, I'll choose box number two. Okay. Okay. And print. I will also show you how to do a secure print. From the test document, click File, then Print. Pick the printer, click on Printer Properties. Once this window opens, we'll again click on the Basic tab. Output Method Print, click here. This time, choose Secure Print. Click User Settings if you've already used this. If it's the first time you're using it, this window will appear automatically. And in this window is where I'll input a document ID and a password, keep it simple. Okay, okay, and print. Now that we've sent jobs to the user box and secure print, let's retrieve them. At the machine, touch the user box button, choose the box where we've sent the job and press open. In this case, I've created a password with this user box. I'll enter that password and press OK. Here, we will see our files that we've sent. We can select them and then press Print. Choose options such as double siding and then press Start. Now we'll print a secure print. Press user box, touch system, Touch Secure Print, enter the password and document ID, press OK, select the document, and press Print. Select Options if we'd like, and Start. That's all there is to it. Thank you.